Hey guys, this is Heather Hope again. I wanted to let you know something today. First of all, if you are listening to this, this is something that you really, really need to hear. I woke up this morning and I went outside and I fed my birds and my chipmunks. I do this every day, but I went outside early and I fed them. A little chipmunk came up as they normally do and I threw a peanut to him and he came up and he grabbed it and he took off and he ate it. And I spend this time every day kind of talking to the animals, talking to my little friends, my furry little friends. And then a lot of sometimes I will walk over to the side of my yard. I love my backyard. I love looking at the mountains and it's, it's just really quiet and peaceful. And I've always, since the moment I stepped in the backyard of this house, have always been drawn to the view. Excuse me. And this morning I was talking to the universe, talking to, this is what I do. I talk to the universe. I talk to myself a lot. And I had this moment with the universe, just a knowing, a knowing that everything, everything I want is coming. Everything I want is done. So I go through these nearly every day. I go through at least one moment of the day that I give myself a pep talk. I give myself a pep talk of as, as a reminder of who, who I am and what it is that I want and that what I want is done. So it keeps me going as a reminder because days can, you know, take its toll on you sometimes and things happen and sometimes you just kind of don't remember. So I want you to remember who you are. I told myself this morning, Heather, you are one, you are part of the 1% who understands how the universe works. You know how they say the 1% makes more than everyone else or whatever that is, right? Well, how I see the one percenters is that they know how this works in some capacity. Either they know it like you and I know it, or they just know something that aligns with how the universe works. Does that make sense? So there's, it's a teeny tiny little percent of people, humans who understand how the universe works. And if you're here, then you know, you're one of the one percenters. So feel incredibly blessed every morning. I do. I honestly feel blessed every day that I understand how the universe works. It's a secret. Now that sounds kind of, you know, the movie, the book, the secret, but it truly is a secret. It's something, you know how it, if something is not known to majority of the people, but it's only known to a small percentage of people. It's a secret. It's a, it's a something, right? We can call it a secret. So we know, we know this secret. We know how the universe works. I was talking to my husband last night and I was telling him, I've said this in the past. I know I say the same things over and over. I told him, I honestly believe, I honestly know that life is supposed to be so incredibly easier, like easier than what we have been told, easier than anything we've ever known before, that we are supposed to have everything that we want. We're supposed to have it. And I truly believe that getting what we want is easy. I know this, like I know that because I, I practice this daily and I test it out daily of things 
And all I do is put my focus on something and say, that's what I want. I want this. And if it's something that can give me immediate results, it will. So let me tell you one thing, just as one tiny example of something that I see happen right in front of me. On my YouTube channel, where you are right now, <laughs> I, I have <clears throat> my analytics up on my screen. I have one of the windows, one of the tabs open to my analytics, and I'm able to watch real time of views on my channel. And a few days ago, it was, I think Friday, Friday evening, it was, it was starting to climb a little bit. And I said, okay, I'd like it to get to this number, which was like, it was just like a thousand more than what it was in that moment. And I hadn't seen that number in a little while, a couple weeks probably. And so throughout the night into the next morning, all I did was see it increase and increase and increase and increase and increase. And every time I do this, every time I look at my analytics, and I just look at it for fun. You know what I mean? Like, and what I do is a lot of times I will look back at really, really high days and I will look at that number and say, that was fun. That was cool. Let's have more of that instead of this is what people do this is what the the 99 percenters do <laughs> they look at how bad things are they look at like current reality if they want something better right means the current reality is probably not what they want right so if it's a low hour or a low day they'll be looking at that and be like oh my god it's so low oh my gosh you know Numbers are tanking, numbers are going down, blah, 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 right? That's the 99 percenters, the humans that have no clue. They haven't remembered like we have. And they, they're they focusing on the current reality that they do not want. And then they keep getting more. And that's how people kind of go into a, into a place where they don't want to be and then they have to dig themselves out they have to find a new strategy to get to increase whatever it is that they just decrease does that make sense so what i do is i just do the opposite of what everyone else does i look back at the high hours i look at the high days i look at all of that and i just say that's what i want i want more of that please i want this number and without any like real attachment without any like striving energy or desperation it's not desperation this is just fun i like looking at numbers sometimes because it's fun because it's real these numbers are real people too the thousands of people that check out my videos every every day they're real people it's you guys so that's fun I find this to be fun. I find YouTube to be fun. I love YouTube. So I talk it up. I get excited about it. I'm like, yes, you know? So I was talking to my husband again with another thing last night about how, you know, in my 2021 list, I was talking about, I've completely changed it up over time. But I think one of the things on there was that I wanted a thousand daily listeners on my podcast because it was going to bring in a certain income from from YouTube views. And you know what's funny is that I didn't get the thousand daily podcast listeners, but I got that amount. And I don't have a daily I don't have a thousand wait, what do I have when I think about it? I don't have that, but I got the result. I got increased views overall on my channel. One of, one of my videos in particular keeps going crazy, keeps going viral, keeps going in my world of viral. You know what I mean? So I got the result I wanted of like the ultimate result was to make this certain amount each day. And I surpassed it pretty quickly in my opinion probably within a couple of months without even without even realizing it because I honestly just realized it last night that this has been going on for about six weeks now that I have 
made that amount of money daily, if not more, based on just one or two of my past videos. It, it didn't come from the podcast, it came from somewhere else. So pretty cool, right? <laughs> it's one of those things where I've said in the past that that manifestations happen and I don't even realize that they happened. That I get the thing that I wanted without even realizing that I got it. Does that make sense? It's one of those things where, you know, you think that getting the manifestation is going to be this big event, this big celebration, this big deal in your life. And then by the time it happens, you're just like, you don't even realize, first of all, that it happened until you actually put your focus on it, your attention. You're like, holy crap, it happened. I didn't even realize that it happened because it was so natural. It was so like next logical step, next logical thing that happened in my life that it didn't, it wasn't a big celebration. It was literally last night. Oh yeah, I've been doing that for six weeks now. I didn't even realize it because it was just such a natural part of me to make more money. I became the person that just expected more money to come to me in various ways, numerous, various, all over the place ways that I wasn't focused on just one thing. That was one thing I was focused on, but I was focused on all over the place. I was focused on abundance, prosperity coming in from everywhere. And when it starts coming in from everywhere, you can't even keep track of it. I can't keep track of it. Not to boast, but I can't keep track of it. It's really interesting where money comes from. It comes from everywhere. And if you, if you just relax and have fun and just keep doing what you want to do every day, it'll happen. So I just wanted to remind you that you are part of the 1% that understands how the universe works. If anything, get excited about that. It is truly the secret of the universe. It is truly the magic. Everything is supposed to come to you. Like what we think is magic, like our human mind, we, we humans think is magic or is a miracle, is just supposed to happen all the time. It's supposed to happen that fast or that easy or that... Like, I didn't even have to do anything for that to happen. It's supposed to happen easily. What you want is supposed to happen. And that's that. It's supposed to be easy, guys. Allow it to be easy. Get into that place where you just expect things to happen. Because that's what you want. Okay. Have an amazing rest of your day, guys. And I will be back again. Bye-bye.